this is Maverick Studios, and welcome back to Let's Play Prison Architect. So we just recently started up a new prison here. We're going ahead and um, working on our cell block, our first cell block, cell block A. Um, we've got our prisoners here. Everything is not finished, though. It's not even really close to being finished, um, unfortunately. But um, we are working diligently. We've got a lot of workmen. And hopefully we can keep these prisoners detained until we finish everything and get everything up and working. Hopefully they don't get too pissed off either. But yeah, um, let's go ahead and get, let's see, micromanagement. Let's get psychology, security, health. Bong. There we go. Oh, he's going to work on that first. You, you can screw off that. Uh, screw off on the psychology too. Just get the health, so that way we can finish that one grant that we had. The, um, health and well-being. So we can finish that one up. And let's just start kitting out the jail cells. So the, the minimum security guys are gonna get really nice cells. I think for medium security, I'm gonna have it the same size that I usually do. Like, the regular size that I usually do. And then... Yeah, I think, yeah. I think that'll that'll be fine. And then max security will get really, really shitty cells. <laughs> but yeah, minimum security is going to have it pretty relaxed, pretty nice. They're going to really love it. Alright, so we'll put the beds on the left. Boom, boom, boom. Bum, bum, bum. And then we'll have our toilets right under the beds or right next to the beds. Here we go. And I think this time as well, I'm only going to have bathrooms. Like, I'm going to have designated bathroom areas. Um, and I'm not just going to be putting bathrooms everywhere because the problem I had last time was, um, what was it called? The problem I had last time was the, uh, prisoners were just digging up shit, like, using the toilets. Like, they were digging tunnels from the toilets out. So, um, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna just have toilets in certain areas of the prison. Uh, where we're always gonna have guards stationed so we can like we can do toilets over here if we wanted to like we'll, we'll just do three toilets for right now Right there And that'll be fine. So there they are and let's also take a look at our regime which we didn't yet So I would like to oh, yeah, also let's put a door right there Okay, so they're gonna go to bed one hour earlier or one, yeah, one hour earlier. They're going to eat earlier, but they're going to have lock up then. They're going to have lock up at 12. All right. All right, I think, I think we'll do this. This is also a really, really relaxed schedule. Not as relaxed as we had it before. It's a little bit more intense than what we had before, but I think this will work out perfectly. Um, like I said, I don't want to have a strict schedule because your prison really works best when you just make your prisoners happy. And if you have a really, really, really heavy schedule, then your prisoners are going to be pissed. And holy shit, look at all of our, all of our beautiful supply trucks. Isn't that, isn't that pretty? Anyways, we'll go ahead, set up those rums, and let's also get these guys bookshelves. Let's see. What can we put in a cell? Bed, toilet. Alright, well, let's just assign the cell areas for right now. And I also want to go to... Can I do it yet? I'm not sure if we can, I can actually do it yet. Contraband, confidential information. I think I need deployment to be able to make this... Minimum security only. So I think for now, um, the cells are just gonna go to really whoever gets them gets them first, pretty much. 
Um, yeah. I think that's how it works. Um, anyways, let's go ahead and see here. I want to get the extra grant from my finance lady. And... Huh. I also want to get maintenance so that way we can get prison labor and cleaning. So we'll do that. Our warden's going to be very busy early on in the game. Later on, though, the warden, like, has nothing to do at all. Alright, well, let's set up an area right here. For our, um... For our reception area. And then we'll have an office desk. Boom. Boom. Okay. So that'll be our reception area. Now let's go ahead and set up some more um, offices. And I'll go ahead and zone those out. And we'll go ahead and get everything that is needed inside. Boom. I, I like how they just kind of walk around the room, though. They don't even use their desk. Like, they make my ass pay for that desk. They don't even use that shit. Like, yo, come on. Come on, my bro. Do we have water going to that? No, we do not. Oh, yeah. Yes, we do. Does it need to go one more? I think it does. But yeah, the water stream should be able to reach it. Perfect. Alright, well, let's have lead pipes. Or large pipes, my bad. Leading up here. Boom. There we go. So all of our cells will get water. <clears throat> Excuse me? Oh, hey, he's drunk, yo. Jesus. What, did one of my officers give him a freaking little shot of alcohol. Okay, so the cell quality... Oh, you can actually see the cell quality now. Okay. So let's give these guys... We are going to give them really good shits. So we're going to give them bookshelves. There we go. So they got bookshelves now. And I'm going to also give them radios. Oh, we can give them windows too. Yeah, f <laughs> they get no windows. They can have radios, though. Oops, I forgot a bookshelf there. Boom, perfect. So there we go. They're going to have really nice cells. The this is, remind you... Um, only for our medium security guy, or I mean our minimum security guys. Our medium security guys are gonna have a little bit, um, less, a little bit less, like, um, a little bit less I inside of their cells. I don't know why I just got choked up there, but, yeah, they're gonna have a little bit less inside of their cells. And why is my lights, why are, why are my lights all messed up in here? Get, let's get lights. There we go. Oh, let's actually cancel those and make it even, though. There we go. Alrighty. So, first day wasn't too, too bad. Yeah, definitely wasn't bad at all. Alright, so let's go ahead and hire our chief. And... I want our chief to... Oh, shit. Okay, we don't have enough money. Did we complete... No, did we didn't complete cell block A. Oh, that's right, because I haven't assigned these rooms. Alrighty. Now we should have completed it? Yes, we did. Okay. Perfect. Now we can have our security guy research all of that. And then we can also go for prison policy as well. And let's also go for bank loan. We won't go for tax relief yet since we're really poor, but... Yeah, let's go ahead and get two more grants. We'll do... 
Uh, we'll do visitation rights and prison maintenance. Because we're already working on researching the maintenance guy right now. So that'll, that'll work out fine, I think. Perfect. Perfect. Let's go ahead and hire some more guards, though. Let's get 10 guards for now. And I want to... Once once we get deployment, I'm going to assign guards everywhere around here. But uh, we don't have deployment yet, so we can't do that. Now, what is the cell quality? Four, which is still average. Come on, my boy. You got a freaking bookshelf and shit. Do they still have money? Psychologist required to show needs... I'm not sure. Oh, I might need to get prison labor. Yeah, I think you have to get prison labor before you can actually uh, get the prison economy rolling. But yeah, 16 nice cells. I like it. So let's go ahead and get some, um, let's get some machinery. Not really machinery, but let's get some tools for our yard here. There we go. And we'll get some phone boots as well. We're not going to wiretap these just yet. We will eventually, but not just yet. Oops. So there we go. Boom. Perfect. I think I might even put TVs in the minimum security cells. Jesus, that guy pissed everywhere. Anyways, um, yeah, I think I might put TVs in here. Put a TV in the corner so we can watch him while he's taking a shit. Yeah, I think we'll do that. Yeah, minimum security is getting get it really, really good. They deserve it for being minimum security, though. At least I think they do. Emergencies. Riot police, paramedics. Nice. Yup. So now we can get all that. Nice, nice, nice. And there's also a fire team now. I've never seen a fire before happen in this. I think, like, when riots happen, I think if prisoners have access to, like, Molotovs or something, they could start a fire. Not exactly sure how fires work, though. Let's get two more offices. Where is it? Offices, offices, there they are. And let's get the needed supplies for those. Boom, boom. Perfect. Alright, so, over here, do we need anything else for our yard? No, we do not. We could probably get a few more tables for our um, canteen. But other than that, I think we're good. So I think we'll only accept next. We'll only accept. Um, we're only going to accept. Let's see. We can take in 10 more guys. And I want as many minimum security as possible. Yeah, we'll get as many minimum security as possible. Perfect. Alright. Great. So let's see. We should be able to search up groundskeeping. Foreman required. Okay. Yeah, I'll get one. So we'll grab all three of those. And we'll hire our foreman. He doesn't have his office built. Oh, no, he does. Okay. Perfect. And then we need to... Okay, yep, and then we need just a gardener and two janitors once he finishes that. So, great. It looks like our danger is going down. Eight prisoners say they are well-treated. Nice. You are well-treated, so don't fucking complain. I think they want family, though, so we should probably get visitation rights up. I think I'll make the visitation area... Um, down here. 
Oh, that's a really narrow pathway. I just realized that. They're like, super narrow pathway for them down there. Yeah, let's let's get that. And then down there. And let's go ahead and get a visitation area. I don't want to spend too much money on visitation. <clears throat> 15 by 15 will work. And just put some visitation tables in there. Uh, we could make that actually shorter, though. Oops. Okay. Yeah, we can do that. But let's make it shorter. No, oh, can we only have it? Ugh. Alright, I guess I gotta redo it. There we go. So it's going to be a pretty small visitation area, but it'll work. It'll definitely work. Perfect. There's everyone. Yeah, they're kind of pissed. The prisoners are pretty dang pissed. But let's go to, um, let's go to nutrition and let's give them the best food possible. Can I do that yet? I don't know if I got micromanagement. No, I didn't. So I can't do it yet. Okay. That's fine. We don't really need to do it just yet, but it helps out. Alright, so we got the cell quality up to 5, which is pretty dang good. And there they go. They're installing all of these stone flooring. Make everything look nice. Oh, we got gang members. Holy shit. Quite a few of these guys are gang members. box. Oh yeah, we need to make a storage area. We'll go ahead and make that right there. Perfect. So our danger rev level going down yet again. Yeah, every time they eat, their danger level is bound to go down. Can we get a psychologist? Yes, yes we can. Alright, so now we need to have a uh, medical ward, and we also need to have a common room. So we'll get those set up. Let's get that connected. Boom. Actually, that should work fine, just like that. Yeah, it should, that should be all right. And then our medical ward, which is going to be over here. Doesn't have to be too big. That's big enough. And we're just going to put regular doors on this. Let's see here. There we go. Perfect. Oh, and we didn't put a wall here, though. Okay. There we go. Can we hire janitors yet? Yeah, now we can. Except we don't have enough money to. Damn. Okay, this sucks. Um, we don't have enough money to hire anyone. Damn. Damn. We need a medical ward. We need to build a medical ward and hire doctors, but we can't we can't do any of our grants because we're we're poor now. So we'll, we'll have to wait a little bit. That's fine though. Um, let's go ahead and fire two workers so we can make a little bit more money. And we really don't even we can fire two guards as well because we really don't need that many. Now let's go ahead and set up deployment. One in the canteen. Um, one in that cell block. Wow, why is my frame rate so bad in this menu? Wow, that is terrible. 
All right, well, there we go. I don't know why my frame rate's so bad in this menu. That is really bad. And then we'll have a guard there. Then we got three free guards. You can do whatever. All right, perfect. I think I think this is gonna work out great. Absolutely great. Yep, so I think it's in intelligence. It's either in the intelligence or logistics that I can actually um, assign this area as minimum security. Oh, they need electricity, okay. Okay, so this is going to be our medical ward. We'll go ahead and set up a wall. Let's see, where's the infirmary? We just need a medical bed, which is 500, and we're too poor to get that. Mm. Yay me. Well, we get our prisoner intake tomorrow, though. We'll get a bunch of money, so we can actually finish up some of these grants and then um, build another cell block, of course. Yeah, I think I should also assign... Actually, let's... Oh, we don't have enough. Anyways, I wanted to hire another guard and, de and um, deploy him in the infirmary because prisoners can actually get drugs from the infirmary. So I think it'll be beneficial if we have it there. Informants. I have no informants. Oh, we got a, we do have gangs, though. All right, so we got that weird-ass thing, and we got something with a cool eagle. Okay. All right, cool. I like how we have that. We have no informants. Recruit prisoners under duress, e.g. in solitary. Okay. So I guess we can pressure inmates to become informants when they're in solitary. Cool. So can I just lock them up in solitary? I can. <laughs> Although that'd probably piss them off and I probably shouldn't do that, but yeah. It's great. It's really great. Yeah, so he's not having any bad feelings. Great. Perfect. 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 Alright, so here we are in the morning. Our prisoners are just about to start their day. They're all sleeping. They're all really, really nice. They do need hygiene. They do need family. We have that visitation area now, so they can go ahead and do that if they so please. We also have a bunch of phone booths set up around the, uh, the area, so they can use those as well. Um, let's go ahead and put, let's put a phone booth there, there. Yeah, just those two places since we're running out of money. We should be getting our prisoner intake in about 30 minutes, though. So we should be good on money. So there they go. They're going to get butt naked and taking their showers. Should probably add more showers. We're out of money, though. There we go. Perfect. Alrighty. So now we got our prisoners. We got 25 now, so we are really going to need that extra cell block. But we also have a lot more money now, so we can go ahead and add uh, medical beds. We can also hire... How many doctors do we need? Two. So there we go. Just got to put those medical beds down, and then we are good there with that grant. And let's also, we need to go ahead and put down some more stone here for our paveway. So there we go. That grant is done. We need to drag electrical cables there as well. And let us see. More grants. We need another grant. Um, yes, that, that'll work. Let's see. We just need to hire ten guards and assign three patrol routes. Well, why are all of our prisoners... Oh, they... Okay. Let's get 15. 15 guards. And let's assign a guard to patrol from here all the way over here. And then we'll have a guard from here all the way down there. And we'll just assign a guard right there. Just so we can finish the task. I am going to keep those other two guards on post, though. 
Yeah, so our guards really have their hands full right now. But that's just because we're getting a huge prisoner intake. Anyways, we need to go ahead and hire a gardener and two chieftains, or two janitors, my bad. And pull that down. Read the CEO's letter. Yeah, we never actually read that. Uh, okay, so we need to build a common room and let us see what else we can do. Clone, I don't need clone. Eagle prep, death row, small cells. Um, we do education. I think that'll work out fine. And let's get two more grants here. Let's get cell block B and... Uh, we'll do governmental security ratings. So we'll have our guy search up armory and dogs. So that way we can get that. And I think I'll actually put my security area possibly down there or over here. I'll have like a little security wing. I think that'll work perfectly. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode off here. If you guys are enjoying this series so far, be sure to leave a like, be sure to comment, and please, please, please subscribe. Also, please, please, please share these videos with a friend, with your dog, with your niece, with your aunt, anybody. It really helps out when you guys do share these videos, and I really appreciate it when you guys do. So thank you, thank you, thank you for watching this video, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye!